Hello, I'm Anika from Made to Sew and welcome to our rolled hem tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to sew a rolled hem on the sewing machine without a rolled hem foot. Now, this is my preferred method of sewing the rolled hem because it always produces fantastic results. So when should you use a rolled hem? I tend to use a rolled hem on all majority of lightweight fabrics. It doesn't work so well on heavyweight fabrics. So things such as lingerie, which I may sew in silk, um, chiffon or lightweight cottons, they're the kind of fabrics that will work the best with the rolled hem. And I really love a rolled hem because it produces such a small, tiny little hem that looks really, really neat and is barely visible. So let's get started. Start by sewing one quarter of an inch, five millimeters away from the finished hem. Now, if I were working with five eighths of a seam allowance, which is 1.5 centimeters, I'm going to start sewing from the bottom of my seam allowance or hem allowance here, three eighths in, which is one centimeter. That will give me one quarter of an inch or five millimeters before my finished hem of five eighths. Obviously, if you have a larger hem, you will need to amend the rule. So you're sewing one quarter of an inch, five millimeters away from your finished hem. And we're just going to sew that with a normal stitch along the bottom edge of your fabric. If you're working with silk, you may find that you wish to make a smaller stitch, maybe work with two millimeters or 1.5 millimeters in length, that can sometimes work better, but please test your fabric before starting. Trim your threads and press flat on the wrong side of your fabric. Next, you're going to turn over, and I'm doing this in a cotton so that you can see the difference in the print. So this is my right side, obviously this is my wrong side. So you're going to turn up the hem, or your seam allowance, so you're turning up a small bit of the right side towards the wrong side of your fabric. You want to see the stitching that you just did and about one eighth of fabric before the fold and you're going to press that. So about one eighth. three millimeters of fabric from the stitching line to the folded edge. Now you're going to sew directly on the line that you previously sewed. So this line should be about one eighth away from the folded edge and you're just going to guide this into the machine, ideally sewing directly on that line. Obviously you will be doing this in the same color thread as your fabric, I'm using a different colour so that you can see it. Trim your threads and press flat. Next, you're going to trim away the seam allowance that we pressed up as close to the stitching as possible. This will be approximately one eighth three millimeters away. Use a sharp little pair of scissors and please be careful to not cut your exterior fabric. Next, turn over the original sewing line and the trimmed edge to make a very, very small hem. You want this to be between one eighth and a quarter of an inch, so between three and five millimeters, and press in position. Now you're going to stitch again on the previous stitching line. Guide that through your machine, stitching on the same stitching line. Trim your threads and press the hem from the wrong side of your material. And there you have it, a perfect rolled hem. And from the right side you only have one row of stitching. 